So you're saying that you can tell just by looking at it that it's going to be a very soupy batch of corn syrup? Yeah, the last couple buckets have been like water almost. Huh. And, uh, oh, it's a little more sour than I expected. Yeah, it's, it's pretty, really pretty soft though. Yeah. I have nothing to compare it to. <laughs> <laughs> I actually haven't done that before. You have to eat a little extra faster. <laughs> hey, at least it's just a half batch for right now. Yeah, that's right. Do you remember the last time you made a half batch? <laughs> no, it's been a long <laughs> time. <laughs> half a batch. We'll see how this smoky almond works out. Yeah. I think you excited good. for it? Yeah. I haven't been this excited for a brittle. I since thought of this one. You did? Yeah. I actually didn't know that. I thought of this one. Wow. All by myself. My dear old dad. <laughs> Come up with that idea all by oh, yourself? Oh, yeah. <laughs> the last time we did one, have you even done a half batch here? Or is it just at the, store, the last shop? Maybe back at the sh old shop, uh, we did a half a batch of. Uh, I think we used to do hard candies. It got to be that way because yeah. we didn't sell that many hard candies before uh, uh, we moved here. Yeah, until we moved here, and then we sold more. Hmm. We we're almost not we hardly made any. Back were you guys there. considering like not even making yeah, any? Yeah, we were considering one, yeah. not making them anymore. But then uh, once you started putting the videos up, and people wanted to buy our candy, so yeah, that's good. Yeah. <laughs> Sounds like an airplane. <laughs> so you, do you think this is going to cook much faster because it's such a small batch? Uh, no, it won't really cook faster. It still takes the same amount of time. Oh, okay. Just like when you're at home cooking pasta or something, if you cook a big one or a small one, it still takes the same amount of time. Hmm. All right, I'm trusting you. Huh. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> so the only thing people missed was throwing the almonds in there. Yeah. I was nowhere to be found. Did it cook as quick as normal? Uh, it did cook a little quicker. Mm. That smelled good. Yeah? Yes. <laughs> I mean, like, I can I agree. Can smell the smoke in it. Like, yeah. I thought someone was like eating something yummy for lunch. I was like, all the way in that other room, you yeah. can smell it. Yeah. I love Bro. smoked things. That tastes <laughs> so good. It smells so good. I'm, yeah. I'm so excited and I just can't hide it. Why would you? That's true. No need to. Okay, throw the scraps in. Uh, there aren't any. Oh, yeah. So, do you want. It smells like bacon. Mm -hmm. um, do you want the smoked. Um, the liquid smoke now? Yes. Okay. I'm doing a half a cup and hoping for the best. <laughs> And you guys did a little bit less salt than Yes, than we did half the amount of salt. Just because the almonds are already uh, salted? Yeah. Oh, that almond. Sizzle in. So this is going to cook out some of the liquid. We're hoping for the best. We do not out. know what's going to happen here. No. Oh, wow, that's, that's a strong liquid smoke smell. <laughs> Ooh, that smells great. I just went by how much I use in my oh, beans. That's a, <laughs> I just inhaled some of it. <laughs> Okay. You hear what I said? What? I went the amount I, I went by the amount I use in my baked beans. Yeah. Okay. Smoked almonds, baked beans. Oh, you know. used a half a cup of that? Uh, no, I did the proportions. Oh, I made okay. three um, three pounds, two or three pounds of baked beans. Hmm. Oh, now they can I can hear them talking about how they can yeah. I've got an offer you can't refuse. How does eighty three percent off, three months free? and 30 days, no risk, money back, guaranteed sound. Hmm? Hmm? Well, if that sounds good to you, then you should check out today's sponsor, Surfshark VPN. Now, if you don't know what a VPN is, it basically allows you to surf the internet with a bit more privacy and allows you to change your location to anywhere in the world. And actually, I use that a lot in order to just make these videos. And don't tell the FBI, but uh, whenever I download videos, when I download YouTube videos that I refer to in these videos, I actually have to use a VPN because the program that I use is for some reason banned in the United States. So I have to use a Canadian server, but all I gotta do is log into Surfshark VPN, find a Canadian server, I'm in. 
But Surfshark can help you do so much more than just download YouTube videos. You can access streaming services that aren't currently available in your country. It can protect your privacy, especially in vulnerable places like public Wi-Fi. And with one account, you can use Surfshark with an unlimited number of devices, so you're always protected. Oh, Dylan, Dylan, Dylan. I'm way too busy being protected by Surfshark VPN on all of my devices all at once to hang out with someone who doesn't even use Surfshark. What a nerd. So check out the link in the description and use code Hercules at checkout to get three free months and 83% off of Surfshark VPN today. Oh, it can only go so low. Oh. He thought of it, Batman thought of it. <laughs> That's chocolate covered. Chocolate uh -oh. covered smoked almond Let's just do this <laughs> Was he salt on top? Let's just do this And caramel first. drizzle. Don't have to worry about it going over the edge of the kettle. Yeah. Just a little time. tiny bit. Oh. A little bitty one. It's still rising though. Mm-hmm. So the only wild part I can think of here is because we've added liquid to this, we've never done that. So yeah. well, we'll find out, won't we? So far it's behaving the way we expect brittle to behave. Yeah, yeah it's just a, just a wee little bad. Not even taking that much of the table. Can we fast forward so we can try it? <laughs> oh, it's coming out nice and clean. Uh -huh. This opens up a, uh, I don't want to talk about this in front of Steve, but. <laughs> well, you can go down a little bit. Okay. Okay. Flavored brittles, you know, if we're at, to add flavoring to the brittles. Yeah. Because maple pecan brittle, I feel like, would be awesome. Yeah. I also think some kind of spicy brittle. Yes. Uh, would go Which well. this kind of is. A long time ago, we made spicy pecans. I don't mm -hmm. know if you remember that. Was it spiced pecans? Yeah. Yeah. There's like there's some cayenne pepper and butter and brown sugar and you know stuff like that. Dough cutter, that's what I need. I need a dough cutter. Yeah. Don't wanna make it too big now. No. This is big enough. Just gotta make it nice. Mm. Same thickness everywhere. Do you want to be on the taste test, Cooper? Yeah. Heck yeah. yeah. <laughs> I think he's excited. Yeah. He doesn't usually get this excited about it. <laughs> I guess somebody else like smoked things too. See, yeah. that's then over there, so make it. Make it I know if we did anything with Mountain Dew, uh, he would be doing the same Mountain Dew? Seriously? Yep. It'll break. Oh my. Oh, no, People have asked for like Mountain Dew flavored things or like cola, just like soda flavored. I, I know they have, but we don't really have, I mean, you have to be able to get those flavors. Yeah. And they don't have them from the, the two companies that we deal with. I mean, they might, might be able to get cola. We've already got root beer, but. Mm -hmm. Or you could just do orange with uh, a baking soda or something like that to make it like, kind of carbonated. I don't carbonated know. kind of candy. Mm -hmm. Okay, well, like the edges thicker, okay? Because they'll break as soon as they hit the counter. Is that like something that can happen with smaller batches, especially? Look well, well, cold quick anyway. No, so it's tiny. just just, uh, just got to be careful on all the brittles. Yeah, when they're very brittle. Them. You mm. did try to make the the sides and all the middle, everything all just a quarter inch thick at least. Mm -hmm. I mean that way, that way you can stretch the whole thing. Mm. Otherwise, you get pieces that are really cold and you can't stretch them, and then um, then, then they break and there's no going back. Okay. Yep. Yeah, that's really thin, so that'll probably break. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, like once it hits the table. And that's the counter over here. It's probably it's, ready right now, huh? It's hard to get. Oh, yeah, I got it. It's hard to get all, gloves the, on. all the same thickness. Yeah. Especially with a little tiny batch. Mm -hmm. Well, Steve, when you used to do the farmer's market, do you want this in half or do you want three pieces? Yeah, we can just do it in half. Okay. Oh boy. We'll wait for me. Yeah. <laughs> I'm not going anywhere. I'm just marking my territory. See? I marked it. That's my see. territory and I marked it. Let's see if it's not too soft. Oh, wait a minute. Okay. Is that too big of a piece? No, it'll be okay. Okay. Okay, go ahead. 
How big a batch did you use to make this by yourself for the farmer's market? How big a batch did you do? Half a batch. So the same size here? Yep. You used to cut it in half too? Yeah. You cut it in half yourself and then bring it over yourself? You yep. Everything yourself? Yeah, I did everything. Wow. There ain't nothing Batman can't do. <laughs> Is this one a little bit harder to stretch than normal? Well, I gotta do a flip here. Mm. Hey, it came out okay. Yeah. I don't, no, it doesn't seem to be harder to stretch. Okay. People want to know we, why we do this flipping. This because uh, this is part of the cooling process. It cools off hitting the counter. Hmm. Is there a way we could hit it with a hammer? <laughs> Oh, looks good. I don't know, people always ask why stretch it too. Why stretch it? The thinner, well, otherwise you break your teeth on it. <laughs> I have seen some very thick brittles with very dense nuts, but I feel like it's very hard to bite them. Yeah, it's yeah. hard to eat then. The thinner, the easier it is to eat. Yeah. And we sell by the pound, so you're not uh, you're not right. getting skimped. No, it's still the same. <laughs> yeah, actually, just better. Yeah, yeah, I like it thin too. Wow, she's getting real shredded over here. Huh? Heck yeah! Woo -wee. I'm shredded, so therefore my brittle's shredded. Yeah, my shredded mom. Yep, shredded like cheese. Hey, when you have to cut her pieces, huh? <laughs> no, <laughs> never probably does. not. <laughs> <laughs> never do. I don't know how I do cut. it. I don't know how I do it, but I do. <laughs> that big old piece is calling my name. Yeah. <laughs> I guess we should make it into three pieces next time. Well, it won't be a next time, I don't think. Next time it'll be four pieces. If we ever do a half a batch again, we'll yeah. just uh, make it into three pieces. Mm -hmm. We just run out of room to stretch. Yeah, yeah, it took too much room <laughs> off. <laughs> How'd you do it, Mom? <laughs> well, look at you, you just went more horizontal, I guess. Yeah. <laughs> Maybe I took up your damn space, I don't know. Yeah. Yeah, what the heck, Mom? It says Mom. it still covers. Maybe it's still covered space, too. <laughs> so now you're doing a full batch? Full batch. Well, either we're going to taste test this uh, almond brittle and then. Uh, you excited for the taste test? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. If it tastes good, we'll make, we've got the full batch on the stove, we'll yeah. make that almond brittle. And then uh, if not, we'll just make a peanut brittle. Yeah. But I, I think it's going to be good. So yeah. it smells, smells great. Yeah. <laughs> Mom couldn't wait. She already snuck a piece. She cheated. No. But that was before it was all cooled down, though. So. Do you guys have this pan to, like, to cool the rubber room down? Right. Right. It's yeah. warm in there, huh? <laughs> trying to cool it. Yeah. Does that change like the, the tempering at all? Yeah. 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 If, it, if it's too warm in there, then the candy will bloom mm. sitting on the trays. Hmm. Trying to work with like, it, it was like 75 yesterday when I was working in there and I was using the fridge yeah. in and out so that it wasn't mm. like cooling down in the room and blooming. It was mm. like having a chance to cool down in the fridge. Oh, you thought of everything, huh? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, you got it. Definitely got it. <laughs> you trying to get through? Okay. <laughs> yeah, it's living now. <laughs> oh, that one almost hit the lens. Yeah. That's all right. <laughs> almost, huh? Almost. <laughs> Yeah, yeah. didn't quite hit it. Okay, I'll get it next time. Right. I believe in you. <laughs> All right. Here it goes. <laughs> this is still pretty s soapy. Yeah. yeah. Boy. Mm. Better, huh? I hope the next bucket's better. <laughs> you just kind of look at the draw? Yeah, yeah, it doesn't happen too often, but mm. once Color in a while. Changes. Yeah, I noticed this one's very yellow. Is it like some more yellow? Some are yellow, superior? some are like more clear, mm. and some are soft and you can barely like... I've tried looking it up online mm. and stuff, but it just doesn't say much about it. It just says... It just doesn't say anything. Yeah, really. says, yeah. I think he, he said something about it's like literally the way they cook it. Like something if they cook it longer or something, it like yeah. turns more yellow and stuff. It's hmm. kind of strange. Yeah. Interesting. 
whoever, whoever was in the kitchen that morning is why they're having trouble trying to get it off. Must have been a Friday afternoon. Yeah, it must have been a Friday. Friday. <laughs> it was Friday at 4. They're like, ah, that's good enough. <laughs> they sent it to Hercules. What do they know? Solid fake. <laughs> You're switching it from the half. Or no, you just switched it from corn syrup to sugar then, right? Yeah. Forty feet. Now these are regular size bags. Yeah. These are, these are 24 pounds. And then when you add the nuts, it's 31. Oh, you didn't even need the whole bag? No. Wow. Oh. 14 pounds. This is a healthy batch of candy, huh? Barely any sugar. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Healthy. Yeah. So the batch we just put together was over there, but you already put another batch together. Yeah, because we're going to make at least, if uh, we're going to make one one full almond one, mm -hmm. uh, which I think we're probably doing that. I'm going to make two peanuts for the, yeah. the rest of the day. Usually on a day, we usually do about seven or eight batches, but I had to do some stuff at home today and I didn't come in until one You're a regular old homeowner, yeah, huh? Yeah. <laughs> I had to come in later today. Handy dad. Yeah, I'm a homeowner, homeowner too. <laughs> yeah, that's just, right. Just two homeowners over, hanging out over here. Yep. I kind of say homeowner. <laughs> but, but it's hard to say fast. <laughs> But the, the main thing that we would change if we didn't really love how it turned out would be like the salt or like the amount of liquid smoke going in, right? We'll yeah, we'll say, yeah, we could, if the uh, amount of uh, liquid smoke isn't enough, we'll just add a little more. So that's why we got to taste it so we know how much to put in the full batch. Right. That's smart. I'm sure the half batch will sell too. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Who's that sound? Ah. Got his favorite. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> like you got this last piece. <laughs> <laughs> you got away with something. Oh my goodness. I'm so excited. Oh boy. Ready? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Alright. Man, this is hard to bite into even though you already stretched it. Mm-hmm. It's really good though. Mm-hmm. You get the smoke. Mm -hmm. 100%. Mm -hmm. I think the way you said the other time, like almond kind of gets lost. I get a lot of almond with like the yeah, smoke too. Mm. That's the taste. That was delicious. Mm. I was worried that it might get soft because of the liquid. Oh. But, uh. I think what you were saying. the saltiness. Could we cut the salt in half? Do you think it's a good amount of salt or? I think it could be saltier. Maybe, maybe, not, maybe, maybe not. Maybe not. Cut the salt. I thought it was just right. Yeah, maybe it had as much salt as you were initially going to do. Because you guys had, you had the salt and then you had it again, right? No. Right at the end? No, we just halved it one time. Well, I, I thought Dad poured some out right at the end. We just put it in the same, a regular amount, you know, that would go in a half a batch. Oh. Okay, I thought he poured some out. What do I know? Well, Apparently nothing. I'm, I, at first I made it. Uh, like a, for a full batch. Oh, oh, and then okay. I realized how I should cut, cut That's cut right, the mystery is unraveling. So, so the this is delicious. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Really is. Mm -hmm. That comes across. Are we happy with the amount of salt though? Do you think? Or how about the smoke? I, I honestly, I think I'm happy with both smoke and salt. Like, I, I, don't want I think I'm happy with you know, like smoke, but maybe a little bit more salt. I guess maybe it'll, it, it I could like the way be it was. saltier, <laughs> but I think the smoke is good. Like yeah, a little more good. smoke. Uh, mm -hmm. Uh, yeah. But the amount of smoke was fine. Yeah. That's yeah. the amount I use my big beans. Yeah. <laughs> That's what I went by. It comes across, yeah. but it's not like all of a sudden now I'm done chewing it and I have like just like gross like weird right. taste. Right. I, I, I was kind of worried that it would happened. because like when she poured it in it, it tasted so strong but then I have to remember it's like for this whole batch though. Yeah. So. Yeah. No, it was, it was like, only a half a cup I used. Yeah. It's like a it's really still, it seemed like a lot though at the time. I used two tablespoons for my beans. Yeah. Because it's very scientific what I did here. Yeah. I guessed. Well. Well, you'll have to make some more beans. No! You have to make some more chili. I'll make chili. No, I'll make beans if you make chili. Is that fair? Okay. Alright. Eight pounds. Oh, it's a good sound. Is that the same bucket that you get your spear pay in? Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, buckets of beer and 
smoked almonds. Oh, that's good. Oh, 290. You just gotta do so many things at once. For the end of this batch? Sure. <laughs> just to taste it again. <laughs> yeah, hey, what if it's different? Just to make sure it's still yeah. good. You, you ready, Steve? Salt, right? Yeah. Get ready for that. Yeah. Whoa. This is where it smells bacony. Yeah, uh, doesn't it? Um, you want to be on this side, Steve? Because it seems to be wafting towards you. <laughs> no, I'm good. Yeah, it's going right towards the exhaust. <laughs> so if you want to. Get out of the line of fire. It smells like straight up barbecue sauce. Yeah, yeah. Not yeah that's, that's what you were saying earlier. Yeah. <laughs> this amazing thing. It's just so unexpected, honestly. Barbecue brittle. Actually, somebody, I think, I swear somebody said something about putting baconing, or not baconing, like barbecue bacon. seasoning in a brittle. Oh. Hmm. She's like, hear me out. I was like, oh, well, you had me at barbecue seasoning. <laughs> <laughs> you don't have to convince me. I, that's a, I mean, this is like a new thing suddenly. Hmm. Savory brittles. Yes. Sweet and salty is mm -hmm. out. Sweet and smoky is in. Yeah. yeah. It's already a salty candy. Salty and savory goes together very well. Heck yeah. yeah. So then they're going to want barbecue, chocolate covered barbecue potato chips. Mm -hmm. yeah. <laughs> Would you like to do that, Steve? Mm, Would you like to do that, Cooper? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, you're going to sully my chocolate. You love when uh, you just get more and more things in. <laughs> yeah, everything more they more make, right? <laughs> just add it on. More skews. <laughs> oh, the more inventory, the better. I'm all, skew <laughs> I'm all skewed up now. <laughs> oh, I'm all skewed up. That initial, like, as the, the water in it, I'm assuming, is, like, burning off, that's crazy. Yeah, I mean, I think it smells awesome. It does. But it if you leave here, you're probably going to smell like you've been near a campfire. Yeah, no, I guarantee you, I'm almost, I'm almost curious to see if the people at home are going to be like, what does that smell on you right now? Yeah, just uh, take a poll. Uh, see what your cat thinks. <laughs> oh, they'll love it. <laughs> <laughs> Steve, you're the best bowl scraper in the world. Thanks. You're welcome. I don't say that to anybody. You only say that to your husband, right? Right. Super close to the edge of the table. I mean, like super ooh, close. Ooh. Okay, can you take this and put it on the button of our barrel then? Oh, oh so. she wants to be on the edge. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Living on the edge. Living out of prayer. Uh huh. Living on the edge of a prayer. <laughs> I don't think I've ever done the kettle handoff, Steve. Hey. Oh, uh, That's okay. Yesterday I pulled ribbon on the hook. Or did I? Nobody saw me do it. Well, Brian well, saw me do it. That's right, you were. Uh-huh. Yep. I didn't do the figure eight. I wasn't going to do that unless my husband was standing next to me. Yeah. Ready to catch me if I fall. But I'll do it next time. <laughs> okay. If you want me to. Sure. Sure. More the merrier. Uh-huh. So we always say when we're pulling ribbon on the hook, <laughs> the more the merrier. Or hard candy. Yeah. Oh, yeah, that's what we were making. We're making yeah. ribbon tomorrow. Yeah. It's, all the same. it's all the same. Yeah, like I'm planning tomorrow. Yeah, I mean, up until it hits the canvas, it's the exact same. Yep. Yep, yep, yep. Oh, yeah, so you've seen, I mean, a lot of chocolate stuff, Brian, but then now you've seen brittle, you've seen hard candy, and then you can see ribbon candy. The only other thing I guess you haven't seen is candy canes, but it's basically exactly the same as hard candy. Yeah. Just for how okay. it's pulled out. That's just made it. You've had a very candy. diversified week. Yeah. You have really <laughs> seen it all this week. <laughs> yeah. It's not usually this. A lot of times it's just chocolate. Yeah. Or we'll do hard candy two days in a row. Much to Steve's chagrin. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. They want to have like, some young guns standing in front of that eater, huh? 
Huh? What? I mean, nothing. You're not a young gun. What? <laughs> Gotta give somebody else a chance. <laughs> Get you. You're a tough guy. Oh, yeah? Tell me why. I don't know. I just go to like, get dizzy, I guess. You think so? Okay. All right, we're doing. I just like to make my little mark. You yeah. got about half. Oh yeah. Okay, so it's my half. Okay. Ready? Quarter. Ready? Yep. Ready? No, I no, I didn't say ready. <laughs> I have, I have to see what it feels like. Yeah. Okay. Twelve seconds later. Oh, snap. Do you not expect that? Steve. Okay, expect Brian, that. you get this one. <laughs> <laughs> Those canvas gloves are doing enough. You'll be fine. Yeah. <laughs> oh, just stick your hand <laughs> underneath there real quick. It's incentive to move quickly. <laughs> oh, he's cut my fingertips off. I got it. Good thing they grow back like a frog. Oh. Go ahead and do it. Okay. Yep, you got it. And then we're going to stretch the edges first because the edges will get cold faster. And then, so just kind of like boom. And you also want to not let the middle get stuck because some of the middle, the middle's going to try to stick. But you are the master of your can. They're not going to allow it to stick. Oh, really, Saturday? Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. The shredders teach them how to shred. Sorry. <laughs> Whoa. Oh, the whole section with no nuts. That's weird, huh? How the hell that happens. Hmm. We have to make sure we bring some home for Kara tonight. Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah. We're going to just the breakfast anymore. <laughs> that was looking really good, Brian. Thank you. Like, yeah, I know. <laughs> I told him not to let his middle stick. Guess what happened to me? <laughs> My middle stuck. stuck. <laughs> Are you excited for another taste test, Dad? Yeah, another one, huh? Mm -hmm. Make sure it's still good. Yeah, I know. Would you guys uh, add a little bit more salt this time, right? This time? Yeah. Oh, uh, well, no, yeah, we did a little bit more, yeah. We and Ron talked about it and decided to just add a little bit more. Company yeah, company meeting, yeah. Is it usually stick as much on the table? No, brought it over a little bit too early. Mm. So it was a little too soft. So that's yeah. yeah, it looks like it's stuck, but it looks like once you get it off, it comes off. Yeah. It comes off. On the hatch. Mm -hmm. Mmm. Yeah, the smokiness comes in like right away. Mm. It's really good. Mm hmm. It's really good. Mm hmm. <laughs> Did I tell you that I just ordered 100 pounds of smoked nuts? Hmm. A, mm. gallon, a gallon of liquid smoke? Mm hmm. We're going to need it. I know. <laughs> this is going to be mm -hmm. huge. Yeah, this is going to be a good seller. Mm hmm. 
Yeah. This might be. I don't know. Do I like this better than pecan brittle? <laughs> Yeah. This would probably be my second favorite behind Pecan Brittle. I think yeah. Pecan Brittle still holds the throne, but mm -hmm. it's a close second. It's right up there, yeah. Good. <laughs> Better Stop. get your order in. Yeah. <laughs> well, it's on the website, so it's going to be a little tough. Mm -hmm. yeah. But by the time this video plays, it will be on the yeah. website. Mm -hmm. And plus, I just ordered a box of macadamia nuts. Uh oh. People were asking, so I've got one 25-pound box. Who knows what we'll do with it. Chuck will cover some, make some brittle with some, see what happens. Mm -hmm. It's expensive. Yeah. I took out I took out a nut loan, mm -hmm. and yeah, I can make it broke into twelve easy payments over the course of twelve years. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so we should be good. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, you did try this. Yeah, it's really good. <laughs> mm -hmm. Do you have a favorite of all the brittles? Um, I like the pecan, but. Yeah. That's this like everyone's favorite. Really <laughs> yeah. Like this could probably be a close second. That's exactly what I was saying. You got a good taste, all. Yeah. <laughs> you like to think so? I mean, I get told somehow. <laughs> all right. Um, I just pulled in 12 ounce bags because it's unique. Mm -hmm. <laughs> just 12 ounces? Just 12 ounces and bits. And, oh, okay. And brittle bits. Yep. So we like the pretty piece on the outside. It's probably not going to look like a hole because the bag is so big. Mm -hmm. The 12 ounces is kind of big. Yeah. So is that like a 16 ounce bag though? Yeah. Oh yeah. So we're at 9. Eleven point eight. Twelve point two. Oh boy! Wow, you're good. I think that's all we got. Twelve. <laughs> oh, twelve point six. Oh yeah. Twelve point six, cause the bag weighs. Mm. Does the bag usually weigh point two? Yeah, point two to point four. Mm. Goes in between. And these are what size? These are bits, which are four ounces. Last two if you want to detect them. Up for the pair. Okay. 3.6. Okay. We're getting there. <laughs> 4 point two. Yeah, so this one is good for people who just like either small pieces or there'll actually be like a, a decent amount that's just the brittle because I know some people have asked before for just brittle without any nuts or without many nuts. Yeah, this one has less nuts because yeah. it's just, if there's leftover pieces that don't have a lot of nuts. Mm -hmm. And you guys because just broke them up into pieces? Yeah. yeah. And it definitely still has all the smoky flavor yeah. that's in the extra brittle itself. Definitely a good size if you just want to try it. Yeah, yeah, me too. Yeah, I, I thought like the, the brittle itself had a little, almost kind of reminded me a little bit of like barbecue potato chips. Yeah, yeah, I was thinking like barbecue sunflower seeds. Oh, yeah, yeah, I can yeah. see that too. Very good. It's, it's very different from the other brittles that we've had. Too. Oh, way over. Oh, way over? <laughs> 4 point eight. Hmm. But the perfect handful, and it's 4.2. Wow. Good work, Al. We're all counting on you. I appreciate it. <laughs> Hi, how can I help you? Can I get some of that liquid smoke? Yeah, I guess. Um, what are you using it for? Um, I'm just mixing it with some smoked almonds. Mixing liquid smoke with something that's already smoked? That's illegal. Oh, my God.